One, two, three, four. Yeah, go! Hey everyone, I'm Nano Elite 666, and you are watching me play Rise of the Kasai. We are back. I'm looking at my level challenges because I just have to find the Tukus. We are back as Baumusu. Here we are, out with our buddy Grizz, who is off somewhere. And we're chasing after some guy named, named my BC or something, I think, who's fallen in with these Kasai flunkies. Who are bad guys, and well, we can't have that. So I'm just killing people! Combo info, yes, I learned this last time. Yes, yes, combo info part two. Oh, oh, oh yeah, you're, you're in pieces, buddy. Play with this again. Oh, 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 oh. Took his head off, made his head fall apart, broke his back. Yeah, we're having a good time, ladies and gentlemen. We're having a good time. Armored guys. Crunch goes the head. Into itty bitty pieces. Alright. Kuzo, what we got going on? More dudes up there. Armored dudes and a horn dude and a health boost. Disturbing birds will attract the enemy's attention. There's birds to disturb. Splattered his head. You know what? I'm not sure which is more satisfying. Chopping people into bits? Yeah, Grizz is over there going foodily, foodily, foodily. There's another save scroll. Large battles. Wait for your partner to help to bring the odds in your favor. Where's the fun in that? There are a fair amount of dudes down there. Nothing like, you know, nothing, nothing on quite like the uh, horde of zombies I had to shoot through at the end of, uh, at the end of the last game. We're going to use the save scroll here. But I made an unfortunate discovery the last time, is that these things are one use only, which is kind of annoying. You are having fun over there, Grizz? Do you think he's having fun, ladies and gentlemen? He killed that guy. I'm gonna guess he probably is. How's it going to get down to me, though, now that I think about it? <laughs> oh, well, let's just go jump into a mass of people and beat them all to death.
Gentlemen! Splat goes the head. Head splats for everyone. Pretty sure this is my version of the spear. I notice. Oh, hi, Grizz. Yes, yes. Because. I got the same kind of spinny, spinny attack that Rao did with his spear. Anyways, we killed those guys dead real good. Still don't know how you got over here, Grizz. Maybe you climbed up over those boxes. That's the end of the level, ladies and gentlemen. Or at least the end of the chunk. had been dabbling in forbidden Kasayan lore. He had discovered the whereabouts of the Mark of Kree and was attempting to retrieve its parts before he was discovered and stripped of his, of his rank. He had located all the marks of the two. We had been instructed to capture him and ensure that these final marks remained. It seems strange to me now that nobody considered the Kasaya threat back then. They were all but wiped out and old. That's his name. Maybe C. That's the guy we're after. Because he's trying to do bad things. Okay. Maybe see. Split up or stay together and fight your way through the last of the Kasai troops to get to the switches that will grant you access to the traitor Maybe see. Let's scout around, why don't we? See what kind of mess we're gonna make. There's a Tuku. Okay, I guess I just gotta go this way. Birds alert enemies. Yes, you told me that already, game. Excuse me, gentlemen. I'm gonna go grab this first. Oh, boys. Roger! <laughs> 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 
Chopping off all the bits. Oh, I, uh, Chris. I could have used that health. <laughs> I just love how just oh his head's just gone. I just love how just nonchalantly you I just you know. I just take a swing and suddenly a dude's been split at the torso. His legs comes off, their heads come off on another swing. It's just, just body parts everywhere. There's just, just dismembered people. Toot toot, motherfucker! Here comes the pain train! Gentlemen. Ladders to other sections. Oh, we can go to s climb ladders, gentlemen and ladies. I don't know why I only said gentlemen. I'm not addressing the guys I'm killing. See, I just turn around and swing and his head comes off. And then his... And then his torso comes off. But it was overkill because his head came off already. Oh, chop. This ladder. I wonder. <sighs> I get the health this time. Oh, there's a thing down there on the boat. I should say. I wonder if the ladder is the way I need to go, or if it's saying, hey, climb ladders, you'll find secret hidden shiny stuff. And if out on the docks was the way I needed to go. But no, it looks like out on the docks is just an extra couple. I, s I see you have arrived, boat. <laughs> Congratulations, you dropped off some guys and I chopped them to pieces. I'm glad we had this talk. Let's go back up the ladder now. Not before taking a quick look around to see if there's another hidden Tuku somewhere around here. I don't think so. Yeah. 
Chris, you didn't run ahead and kill everybody in front of me, did you? No, nope, you're waiting. Got him. <laughs> hey, buddy, are you next? Yes, he is next. And his head has barely been removed from his legs. And his shoulders. And his neck. Legs are attached attached to... Light, er, heads are attached to legs, right? That's how bodies work, right? No. I mean, in a roundabout way, I guess they are. They're attached to your legs by proxy of... Yes, yes. Horn sentries open doors. Oh, did you just cancel me out of my combo, you little shit nugget? Well, that's a big old swing. I gotta do that to more dudes. Alright, Grizz, I think we got them all. I hear the thing nearby going, oh, oh. It's right behind that door. There's ladders. Ladders to switches that do things. Your Grizz is going to climb up the other one. But before I do that, I gotta go wander back that way real quick. Because there might have still been stuff back there to find. Or there might not have been, and there was just a dude that I murdered. There's a safe scroll. Stealth killing a horn sentry. They did stealth kill very well. I wasn't even aiming for him, and his head came off anyways. Alright, buddy, back away from the wall. That works. Maybe. Whoa!
What the fuck was that bullshit? What? You saw that, ladies and gentlemen. He didn't die. Now he's dead. Let's see him get back up from that one. A stupid son of a bitch. <laughs> I'm just gonna lie on the ground while you repeatedly ram your axe into my backside. But I won't actually die. Because fuck you. Yeah, I don't see nothing else. Alright, let's go pull these switches. I have to pull them both myself. Grizz, why couldn't you do it? Why couldn't you climb up and pull the other switch? I'm going to feel really weird playing this whole game and talking about Grizz because I used to have a cat whose name was Grizz. And, you know, I'll always think I'm talking to my cat now. The great Baumusu and Grizz. An honor indeed. May pity hand over the scroll or taste my steel. <laughs> or taste my steel? I don't think so, Barbarian. Your steel is no longer a match for my skills. This is the fifth part, Rakus. Now I only need the child to complete the spell. We will die before we let that happen, traitor. You cannot stop me, Rakus. I already know her location. It's too late. No one can protect her. Kasai. Smell their taint on you from here. Fool, Rakus! Kneel before me, who bear witness to my power! Grace, defend yourself! Dark magic is afoot! Save progress? Yes. Looks like we got an end fight happening. Alright, who the hell is Mabisi's voice actor? Uh, he sounds familiar. Oh, confront the tentacle beast! What? Destroy the tentacle beast. Different weapons have different effects on the enemy tentacles. Watch out for the grabber. What? I got a spine in it. That's nice and messy. There's a Tuku. We'll go get it. Oh, 
Unfortunately, I think I missed one. Bit off real good. Did we get it? I think we got it, ladies and gentlemen. We done did kill the tentacle beast. That was interesting and unexpected. We had a real live, honest to god boss fight! Very painful looking stick, Grizz. I remember that the Kasai were not what they are now. Back then they were all but destroyed, yet there had been many of them at Tapuro, and maybe he commanded them like a general. And what of the strange beast conjured from the ground? It had been eons since anyone had possessed such magic. Had maybe she studied enough of their black arts to command such creatures? Now maybe she had all of the parts to the mark of Kree save one. A mark that was on the back of a defenseless infant. We had many questions that needed to be answered. We know whose back it's on. All right, well, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see, that's going to wrap it up for this part. Because it is about that time, and we just finished the level. So, you know? Yep, three or four. Nope, didn't get into it. So, ladies and gentlemen, it's going to wrap it up for this part. Once again, I thank you all for watching. I hope you have been enjoying. As always, if you have any suggestions or recommendations for games that you think I should play that might make for a good series like this at some point in the future, or if you just wish to give me a shout, give me some feedback, let me know how I'm doing. Am I doing good? Am I doing bad? If I'm doing bad, what can I do to go from doing bad to doing good? Or if you just wish to inform me that I'm a terrible person because I missed one of the Tukus in, in the level, and you know, I think about it, it was probably off, off the other way on the split path where me and Grizz went our own separate ways and killed dudes. I probably should have backtracked and gone, gone his way and it probably would have found it somewhere there and so I didn't find it and I didn't get all the challenges you may inform me of such in the comment box below PC, PS4, and Switch for recording suggestions as that is all that I can currently record on right now and as always if you enjoyed this video and want to see more like it then please subscribe to the channel that way you'll be kept up to date whenever I post up new videos and then you won't ever have to miss out on any of the shenanigans that go down in this my little corner of the internet also, if you know of anyone else who might enjoy watching this sort of thing, please share this video or one of my other videos with them. Point them in my general direction so maybe they might potentially swing by and be entertained by the shenanigans that go down in this little corner of the internet. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, once again, I thank you all for watching. I hope you have been enjoying. I am NanoElite666, and I will see you all next time.